This story and more is brought to you by Book Club Audio, the Australian audiobook marketplace. Find more amazing stories at bookclubaudio.com. Visitors for lunch. We're having visitors for lunch today, said Mummy, as she wiped the kitchen bench. I'd rather have pork chops, laughed Daddy. Wouldn't you, kids? Jojo and Sam giggled. Sometimes Daddy was so corny. Mummy smiled. I met a lovely lady at work and invited her and her family to our place for a barbecue. What are the kids like? asked Jojo. Mummy said, they're about the same age as you and Sam, so you can all play together. And the daddies can stand round the barbecue and tell dad jokes, said Sam with a cheeky grin. And your mummies can make salad and talk, finished Jojo. Everyone laughed. Jojo and Sam lived in a big house with a big garden around it. There were lots of shady trees, a cubby house and swings and grass that went right down to a river that even had a little sandy beach. Sitting on high stools at the kitchen bench, Jojo and Sam thought of things to do with the visiting kids. Well, we like playing superheroes, said Sam. And kicking the footy, said Jojo. We could show them how to catch the little blue mud crabs, suggested Sam. They might get their fingers nipped, <laughs> giggled Jojo. It sounds like both of you will look after our small visitors very well. Mummy smiled as she wrapped her arms around Daddy. Later, Sam met the visitors at the front door. Hello, my name is Samuel Sebastian West, but my mummy calls me Darling. And my name is Jojo. And my name is Roz. And my name is Harley. All the kids laughed. Instant friends, just like that. The grown-ups shook hands and chatted, walked through the house to the back deck. The kids raced through the house, across the deck and down to the little beach. Kicking off their sandals, the kids splashed into the shallow water, pushing and shoving and laughing like they had known each other for ages. The grown-ups smiled proudly. Later, Daddy shouted from the back deck, Hey kids, who wants a banger sanger with Marty Sauce? Our daddy makes corny jokes all the time. Sam rolled his eyes. So does our daddy, said Roz. Sometimes we laugh just so we don't hurt his feelings, said Harley. After lunch, the daddies kicked the footy with the kids and the mummies sipped their drinks from pretty glasses and laughed together. The kids took turns on the swings, played hide and seek among the trees and ate ice cream inside the cubby house. Hunting for little blue crabs on the beach, Harley lifted up a rock. Got one, he shouted. Ouch, it nipped me. Jojo looked at Sam and giggled. I'll show you how to do it, said Sam kindly. Later, the West family stood in the driveway of their house and waved as the visitors drove away. Can we have visitors for lunch again? Sam asked. I'd still rather have pork chops, said Daddy with a smile. Oh, Dad, groaned Sam. Oh, Dad, echoed Jojo. That night, in Roz and Harley's bedroom, Harley looked over the edge of the top bunk. I had the best day ever today. He flopped back onto his pillow and his mummy pulled the doona up to his chin. Good night, darling, his mummy said. Roz murmured sleepily. Jojo and Sam have the biggest backyard in the whole world. They sure do, her daddy said. Good night, darling. Love you.